The Atacama Desert in Chile is rich in lithium. The element is an essential ingredient for batteries in products from cell phones to laptops. The hope is that the technology will also power millions of electric cars in the future. Some 70% of global lithium deposits are located in the Andean countries, Chile, Bolivia, and Argentina. The deposits are processed in state-of-the-art factories in Europe, the US, and Japan, where developers are trying to come up with more efficient ways of powering electric cars. If they're successful over the next few decades, lithium supplies could soon start running low. One substance that's already in short supply is coltan. Much of the world's coltan ore can be found in the Democratic Republic of Congo. It's extracted from small, often illegal mines by people working for a pittance. Those who profit are, for the most part, armed militias. Many observers believe the struggle for control of coltan has been fueling the conflict in the region. For that reason, it's often described as blood coltan. Coltan is essential for the production of cell phones and small computers. It's just one of an increasing number of coveted raw materials needed for the manufacture of high-tech products. China is in a strong position as regards rare earth metals. Open cast mines like Bayan Obo produce most of the world's scandium, neodymium, and lanthanum. They're vital components in the manufacture of solar panels. Beijing was recently accused of restricting shipments, and German companies had to scale back production as a result.